are going well. We're back at Mission Control. But before we do anything else, we need to use the Wheel of Invention. The Wheel or Wheel? Time to finish up another mission. Click the on button to start the wheel. <laughs> Welcome back to Hollywood Squares. Come on, mate. Welcome to the game show that asked the age-old question, where on earth is poor Eraserbot? <laughs> That's right, it's Hollywood Squares! What? Your first clue is a book. Books can take you anywhere you want to go. This book will lead you to what this mission is about. Guess what the best-selling book in the world is? It's the Bible. Who was the first author to write a book using a typewriter? Uh, probably Shakespeare, right? Nope. nope. Shakespeare was a remarkable. Uh, I was either Shark Twain Shakespeare or Twain. Homer was like a long ass time ago. To a publisher, Mark Twain wrote Tom Sawyer and Huckleberry Finn. Are you looking for Mark Twain? Most of Mark Twain's books are long stories he made up. What are these types of books called? Novels. Yeah. Mm. Novels are stories about made-up people and events. Which of the following was invented before novels? Tragedies. Right, E.O. <laughs> Writing is the way to express speech in symbols, and it was invented long before the novel came into existence. The invention of writing is also what this mission is all about. You know, I never did fix the phone. Is it still charging? Let me check. Just answer the next questions correctly, and we'll be on our way to the time when writing was invented. Your second I actually can't tell if it's charging. The brick will tell you who invented writing. Bricks are the ultimate in recycling. They're made from clay, and clay, you see, is made from rocks that were ground up by erosion. If you heat up clay, I redid the plug of the phone. Like I don't know if it's good or not. Broken rocks, a new rock is born. What was first used to harden clay into bricks? No. No. Nope. Oh, Lock I'm an idiot. I'm out. Right. It's bricks saying harden. I'm, I'm not even thinking about the sunlight. I'm just thinking of like sun. cooking in general. Which region on Earth gets the most sunlight? The desert. Fantastic. One of the reasons it's so hot in the desert is that the sun shines there so much. Which people lived in the desert? Your I was about to say, I think the Mayans are rainforest. The Sumerians had plenty of sunshine, and they used it to turn clay into bricks. They also drew symbols on wet clay tablets that were hardened by the sun. These symbols called cuneiform were the world's very first writing. All right, so the Sumerians invented writing. Only two clues left, and we'll know exactly where we have to go to find a racer bot. Keep going. Your third clue is a glass of water. It will show you where writing was invented. All animals need water, but not all animals drink it. The kangaroo rat gets all of its water from the plants it eats. Which plant has saved the lives of desert travelers who can't find a glass of water? The cactus. This is a barrel of fun. <laughs> desert <laughs> travelers <laughs> Listen to my puns. Wow. Inside the barrel cactus and squeeze water out of it. As its name suggests, the barrel cactus looks like a barrel. Which of the following is stored in barrels? Oil. Oil, right! Uh -uh. Oh, my lord. Oil was formed from the remains of tiny plants and animals that lived in the ocean millions of years ago. After oil is drilled from the ground, 
It's shipped around the world in containers called barrels. <sighs> Some countries have bigger deposits of oil than others. Which region of the world has half the world's oil? The Middle East. oil -a -rama. The Middle East controls so much of the world's oil supply that it has become an extremely important region to the rest of the world. The Middle East is important to you right now because that's where writing was invented. Ooh. Hold on to your head, Eraserbot. We're almost there. Your fourth and final clue is a rubber tire. It will roll back the clock to the time in history when writing was invented. They once tried to make car tires out of wood, but they chipped when you hit a pothole. Rubber makes the best tires. The rubber tires on your bicycle are made from artificial rubber. Where does natural rubber come from? Great job! Rubber was originally made from the milky sap of Brazilian trees. Which part of trees is protected by bark? Oh, the uh, wood. You barked up the right tree. Oh my lord, the sky. Bark is the dead outer shell of the tree that protects the living wood inside. Desks, doors, shelves, and tables. Think of all the things made This from is going to be a BC question. When was wood first used for making wheels? That's right. The Sumerians made wheels from wood around 3500 BC, which is around the same time they invented writing in the Middle East. Okay, we did it. Now let's find a racer bot before the history of writing gets erased. He always wants something to say, but I, you know, I think he says like how good we are. Heck yeah, brother. Click on me to this should be cool. We get to travel back in time over five thousand years. The Sumerians in the Middle East are about to invent writing. Watch out, Mr. Sumerian! The racer bot, the robotic graffiti remover, is about to erase the history of writing! Oh brother, he's trying to chisel away at the computer keyboard. Hit the button quick! Before he makes the word processor look like it's been in the food processor. <laughs> now that's better. The Sumerians carved their writing onto clay tablets. Word processors came way, way later. Make sure your seat backs are in their upright locked positions while I take us home. <laughs> You know, this looks like its own, like, actual area of the mountain, but I forget it's kind of a small room. Uh, there's no place like home. Hey, things are looking up here. We've added another robot to the roost. Can you say sweet dreams? Hmm, another robot safe at home. I bet you think you're the smartest little robot in the world now, don't you, Gutley? Well, you're not as smart as I am, and I'm going to make the next mission so tough, you'll beg to be taken to the scrap heap. For sure. Let's take a look at that transquizzer and select another mission. Click on the inventory. I know I don't normally do this with this game, but I'm kind of in a hurry Let's to, take a look at that like, cycle, so I'm just trying to run things along, uh... Anything outside of 15 minutes to 20 minutes, I just hit Click stop on and start, start on. Button if you want to hear this. Let's go. Bologna, frankfurters, wieners, and salami. They're all types of sausage. Sausage is a mixture of flavorful meat that's wrapped in a casing and cooked. And that's no bologna. Oh, my lord. These puns. What was the outside of the world's first sausage made of? Daddy's mother put everything she had into making her homemade sausages. They were so odiferous. 
Daddy used to say they tasted like her old socks. So I guess that's what sausages are made with. Old socks. What? Mm, mm, mm. That's the secret ingredient. Oh my god. Old socks have been used for centuries as the casing for sausages. Now you know where socks go when they disappear. I swear, if there's a socket to your joke on this. Imagine that. Sausages made from old socks. What will Polly think of next? We can put a stop to this. We can suck it to Polly once. Oh before. my god. Click on the what did I just say? The if there's a socket joke, I'm gonna freaking. I should be able to do two more games and then recharge up the thing. Not so fast, Hose Breath. I've got Sockbot on my side. Sockbot. And he's stepping out into history. If you want to follow his sock footsteps, you'll need to find these four clues first. Okay. A hot dog, a clock, a piece of coal, and a motorboat. Motorboat. Motor. Sockbot, the smelly robot? I can't believe they let him out of his shoe. I wouldn't subject people to his smell. We've got our work cut out for us. Hold your nose. Alright, let's see what we got here. If we get the I maze, I might be fucked. Try to scent this area out. No doubt about it. There's a clue in the observatory. Cool. I can do the observatory. Actually, the observatory actually doesn't take that long, so I may as well do it. I'm just gonna speed through I this. I sense that Polly's launched another one of the mission crews into space. Get ready for a fun packed thrill ride to the bottomless pit. Let's go. I have no idea what's in store for us this time, but we have no choice. Click on the telescope. The thing that would suck right now is if the game crashed. Transmission and our hit. Better act fast before it's sucked into the black hole. Polly's using six radio packets good. Looks like a shower of comments is approached. Wait a maneuver. You got a nice shoot. You got a radio crate. You got another radio wave pack. Nice shoot. You dealt with that kind of yeah. Wait a maneuver. You got another radio wave packet. I got it. You got Thank all you, the brother. Now we can decode Polly's hit. Once again, it's all scrambled. That's okay. They call me the King of Centaurs. I see what's happening. Oh, uh, I know, I know which one he is. Actually, wait, isn't it just Kieran that we're looking for? You managed to find a real sentence. Great. Okay. Uh, there is a constellation that does look like a centaur, so. It seems the sentence is assembled correctly. I'm not an ordinary man. You make quick sense out of that messy sentence. Not done yet. There's more to figure out. Not done yet. There's more to figure out. It seems the sentence is assembled correctly. There you go. Oh, you make quick sense out of that messy sentence. Okay, now here's the next piece of Holland's glue. I, see what's happening. I can we shoot the scorpion with my deadly arrow. Oh, you make quick sense out of that messy sentence. Not done yet. There's more to figure out. I stand. Oh, with. With an arrow in the sky in my hand. I stand with an arrow in the sky 
in my hand. Oh, I stand. Okay, I stand in the sky with an arrow in my hand. I'm like, what the hell? Great! You decoded the entire hint. They call me Chiron, King of the Centaurs. I am not an ordinary man. What man has a horse's tail and four legs? Centaurs are ferocious like wild horses. I can shoot the scorpion with my deadly arrow. I stand in the sky with an arrow in my hand. All right, here we go. Wait, you won't scramble Polly ship. All right, let's see. Let's just try to get this wrapped up. Eridanus is a mythical river. Sagittarius represents Chiron, the king of the centaurs. The centaurs were men from the waist up and horses from the waist down. Chiron, the archer, points his arrow at the heart of the scorpion. He was brave and wise. Chiron arranged the stars into constellations so that men could use them to tell directions and to foresee the changing seasons. You know, I just realized that Scorpio is directly is under Sagittarius, and Sagittarius is aiming the arrow at Scorpio. Hear that? You must be right. And here I, I never even shot. made that connection before. We made it! Hey, that was great. Back on Yay. the floor, Drek. We need to check out another floor for mission clues. There aren't any here. Yep, give me a second. <laughs> 